Oh my gosh, I look horrible. If you're watching this, I'm extremely uncomfortable. <laughs> hey guys, today we're talking about ideas for your school's reels if you hate to be on camera and show your face. This is a tricky one because unless you look like Brad Pitt or Beyonce or insert celebrity here or you're a professional model, it's tough to be on camera. I'm extremely uncomfortable right now. I don't like being on camera. We get so critical of ourselves and how we look, how we sound. <clears throat> And it makes sense, we're intrigued by people. Even as babies, we look for faces and we see faces in toast and in clouds. And if we wanna start engaging and converting our audience, we need to produce video content. 98% of marketers feel that video performs better than other types of content. On Instagram alone, video posts are twice as more likely to get engagement than posts with just images. So you combine the popularity of video with faces and that's a great mix for engaging content but we're often our own worst critics. It's tough to be on camera. And that really goes against some of our goals is that the students and the faculty and the school community are the stars, not us. But just because you're uncomfortable being on camera, there are still ways that you can produce reels that are engaging, that are funny, that are emotional. Even if you're feeling like today is just not a camera day. So show a before and after. This is great for if you have campus updates or you want to do a throwback Thursday, show the before and after of a space. Take a walkthrough or a tour of an interesting spot on campus. Record a tutorial, and this is great if you've just launched a new website and you want to show people where to go and find the things that they're used to finding elsewhere. So there are certain things that just look cool in a time lapse, and maybe that's an audience or a crowd filling a spot or a building going up. All you really need is a sturdy tripod and a smartphone. Go where others can't, like a behind the scenes tour of a theater production, or maybe a special lunch is being made, or maybe the teams are getting ready for practice. Do a POV, like a flip through of your view book or other marketing materials. You can show a text only video or a motivational quote and animate that for a reel. Do a hands or feet point of view. Film a favorite spot on campus, and this is great when your school is on breaks or during the summer. It helps connect people back to campus. Reuse audio and create your own content. Feature a favorite recipe or a book from a staff or faculty member. Yeah. So when creating content, you should always try to feature someone, but if it feels like it's just a bad hair day or you're just not ready to be on camera, there are always ways to create engaging video content and reels for your school.